Dylan, what was it like out there playing uh, playing with Paige Pierce, Eagle McCann? How was that? Yeah, I mean they make, I mean they make some shots that are I can't even fathom even trying. But um, I mean it was it was cool watching them for sure. Yeah, and you know a lot of people always say like baseball translates really well to disc golf. You look at our you know best player in the world, Paul McBeth, and ex baseball, he's a former baseball player. Uh, what stuff do you take from being a MLB pitcher to the disc golf course? I mean it's pretty similar in terms of like it's a mechanical game. You know you gotta be able to put your body in like a you know, the position to execute your angles and then kind of trust that your body's going to do it. Um, but I mean, I'm not an expert at disc golf. I, you know, <laughs> I just play for fun. But um, yeah, I mean, I'm throwing one thing in another sport, throwing one thing in this sport. You know, it's, yeah. it's, it's pretty similar. Have you, I know a lot of people who bat righty like to throw lefty because it's mm. like the same kind of thing. Have you tried throwing lefty? or do you I have. I threw lefty towards the end of my off season just because I didn't want to risk doing anything with my right arm. Mm -hmm. uh, but I definitely am not a lefty. I mean, speaking of that, do the uh, how do the White Sox feel about you know star pitcher being out here playing a celebrity pro am disc golf tournament? Uh, you know, I mean, they probably want me to make sure I take it easy, but you know, I mean, I'm out here to win, so I got to give it all I have. Yeah, exactly. That's that like pro athlete mentality. I, yeah. I, I've noticed that with a lot of the celebrities who are like pro athletes, like whether they're MMA fighters or whatever. Yeah. Like all you guys are wired. Like it's not like. Oh, if I make a bad shot, I'm not happy. Yeah, you know, exactly. like we're we're out here for fun, but. I'm not happy if I make a bad shot. Yeah. Um, what's it like seeing Paul McBath as like a former baseball player? Like, does that are you, I, is there anything in the back of your head like, dang, I could have like if Paul's a baseball player now he turns into a disc golfer. Maybe if I had done something a little different, I could be the best disc golfer in the world. Or is that like not even a thought in your head? I I haven't really thought about that. Just mm -hmm. I like my job. You know, like for me, disc golf's like just the perfect hobby. Um, I mean, I, I love playing it. I might do a, a disc golf YouTube channel this off season. We'll see. Um, yeah, but I haven't really thought about that. Just, you know, I'm, I'm happy with where I'm at. But I think if I pursued disc golf, I could be pretty good at it, honestly. Yeah, I mean, we saw you throwing a few shots out there. It was like, it, it, was, it didn't look like someone who is just throwing their first disc yeah. the first time. Yeah, no, I, uh, <laughs> I played probably four or five days uh, a week this off season with my brother. Oh, wow. So between COVID and then this off season, I was able to get a lot of practice, but I was, I was not good at the very start, but I've made strides. I've definitely made strides. Awesome. And last question for you. What are you, yeah. what are you looking forward to uh, for round two? The actual celebrity pro, mm. we're gonna match up with the pro. Yep. Um, obviously you're looking to take it down. What's yep. uh, what are you looking forward to round two? I mean, I want to get, ideally I want an ace in there. I want something highlight reel that, you know, some highlight reel plays. Yeah. Um, some electric putts where I can make, maybe scream or do something fun like that. Um, but at the end of the day, I want to take home the trophy or whatever. The is there going to be a trophy? I don't we need know. a tr we need something. We need something. Yeah, absolutely. a plaque, a trophy. Uh, yeah, I'm here to win. Awesome. And message to all the Southsiders out there who are just like mm. Southside's electric right now. Oh. The White Sox. Yeah, guaranteed rate. I mean, keep it up because that place is absolutely electric when we play. We can feel that energy.